villages under the water, affecting those who survived the country's deadliest typhoon just two months ago. More than 100,000 families in the southern Philippines were evacuated after days of continuous rains that resulted in floods and mudslides. They forced residents to flee to higher ground, using schools and local government buildings as evacuation centers. We're in a grave situation. No food, no milk for the children. It's wet everywhere and we have no place to sleep. It's a stark reminder, says the United Nations, that more needed to be done to help millions of people who are living in shelters after being displaced by Typhoon Haiyan. The country gets hit by an average of 20 storms and typhoons each year, along with frequent earthquakes. The UN says the temporary shelters given to Haiyan survivors are not strong enough for the extreme weather. Marie Koi, BBC News.